This is the Joy Trip face and body tracker. Got a built in 2200 milliamp battery. It does come in multiple colors. So you can pick which one you want. You can use it for vlogging. You can use it for FaceTiming or just to film yourself or somebody else. It does work on a tripod if you want. That bottom stand is removable. Like I said, it's pretty simple to use. Instructions are pretty much one page. Chinese on the other side. You can see this, you got a removable stand. It does have a quarter inch thread on there. This it does use a C type USB charging cable. This is kind of short, but we'll take one to two hours to charge this, depending on how charged this is. You can see it's about seven inches tall. With this base, it's about four inches wide. So there's a quarter inch screw hole on the bottom here. So you can use just a normal tripod if you want, instead of this little stand, or if you got a mini tripod. There's your camera. This holds pretty much any phone you got. This is all manual, so you do have to turn this. You can go vertical or horizontal. This also tilts back, so you can tilt it back as far as you want. That way if you're like in front of it, maybe you're filming yourself doing something. You can tilt this up and have it facing you, maybe for like FaceTime or something. It's pretty simple. Let's see if this has got any charge to it. Oh boy, there's your charging port on the back. The LED light does turn red when you're charging it. And I believe this turns red when it needs to be charged. So you push and hold the start button here on the top for three seconds. So I can feel it. It does an auto testing. This should be probably on here when you turn this on. Because then it'll rotate itself. Or at least it's supposed to. Let me turn this back off here. So you push and hold this for three seconds, turn it on and off. It should auto rotate and test itself to make sure it's working. And you should have your phone on there and adjusted right. And then when you're ready for this to start working, you push this once to turn it off or to pause it. And then you push it again to resume it. So let's see how my phone fits in here. i try this. Pretty simple, pretty easy. It doesn't take an app. So if you're Putting your camera on. I like to do things vertical. Let's switch this around at me. See as I move, the camera moves. It doesn't move real fast, so you can't move too fast or it's not going to see you and move. That's not too bad. I like it, should get it. 